What are you throwing at? Today? Today we had an old mud cat. But uh, flat, muddy river bottom, Mississippi River mud cat. A what? We can't hear you, sir. Flat, muddy bottom, Mississippi River mud cat. Gotcha. And where do you find them at? At the bottom, deep. venturing off in the distance he left me over here but he left me over here with something very 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 important uh, he left me over here with his neck now my cross the creek family y'all know when somebody leaves some i get after he's left me with his neck i'm thinking about seeing if i can get it hemmed up got to see if i can get it hemmed up but i turned on this camera because i wanted to show y'all this uh shell cracker I caught. He ain't too big but uh I've got a little bit of a problem with him and I want y'all to show I want to show him to y'all I might name him Richard Jean I don't know but uh the problem we got with this shell cracker I was going to keep him but the problem is his eyes is just a little too close to his tail so I don't know if I'm going to be able to use him I don't like putting fish in my pond to have a problem a little too small for what we want but stay tuned, y'all. We're going to keep rallying them up. And we'll check back with y'all when we pull something else in. Jesus style. Jesus style. They said Jesus turned a bread and a bottle and into fed the whole village. Look like Chris in here feeding the whole village. Whole village. We're going for a ride. Sit right there and don't move. Just like we used to do with AJ. Our cousin AJ. Don't move. Stay tuned. We heading over to meet the guy to hand over some bait and we're gonna get out of here. We'll catch you guys here in a minute. 
We turned on the camera right here because we thought we located a turtle. But if we see one and we catch him up, y'all will see that. And if the gentleman I met catches anything good, y'all will see those fish too. So stay with All right. We don't know if y'all seeing that or not, but we're wearing them out pretty good today. Crawfish and such and everything. I'm talking about we wearing them out, y'all. Listen, straight drop. We're going to get these fish loaded up. Head to a different area. You know. We'll holler at y'all when we get out to camp on 316. Stay tuned. Sitting on, uh, on about eight bunk eggs and about three game eggs. Kind of wanted us to come in and check out. We made it to our destination. Camp 316. You got chickens left, right, up, down. Whichever way you look. They look like they mean business, too. Look like they mean business. We're going to try to catch up some of these chicks. And we're going to take them home, put them in the brooder, grow some out for Marquise, and grow some out for our self as well. And uh, maybe you guys get to see that show and watch us run them down. Stay tuned. If y'all see that rooster up there, the back side of that plow there, that's Black Ace. That's the one that's putting a whooping on Marquise in the previous video that y'all saw. He's out running. Loving this new place. He's making himself at home. But let's get to catching some of these chicks up. Hold one up. <laughs> that mama hen coming all around to see him. We got him counted up in the orange bucket there. What we're going to do is try to get him set up in a brooder. And we're going to grow him up. And yeah. Let my kids decide what he wants out of. Got beautiful birds flying everywhere. We've caught most of them up and we're gonna take them back and get them set up. And... He said this is Hatch McLean rooster right here. Around here on the bottom. Oh, Lacey, they game. I know that Lacey round here. I'm trying to figure out where we're going at. It's for him. Yeah. I tell you what, why don't you go after the mama and we'll put her in this dog crate? We'll put her in the dog crate and bring the dog crate over here. She called. Game, game as can be. Game, lace around me. Game. Oh, hands on something. I knew she was coming. I, oh, I knew she was coming. Hell of a time. Sometimes, y'all, I just don't know. Maria put the bucket up in the hatch of the truck there and didn't put a lid on it. The truck is overrun with baby chicks. Y'all remember, be patient with your woman. Stopped in to gather some chicks over at Marquise's. And the Corvette caught my attention. Thinking about firing it up. Nice. Not a big fast guy, but I do like old. Everything looks redone and nice. Two of them today. <laughs> two of them. One, two. They catching them chickens, dropping them. That was a rooster too, one. Throw it on. That's that exotic I, color. I can't even show y'all what my quiche just did. We made it home with a good catch. <laughs> Nothing's going in to catch them all. Everything's dead. We're going to put a couple of these carp that we got still alive in here, hoping they can do some cleaning from the bottom. We'll let those go in there. There he is, coming on down. Crawfish there on the side. We'll knock out a few tasks and get back with y'all here in a minute. The creek. Listen, so far we've lost. One chick and about 10 fish. I've about had it. Y'all, this is the end across the creek. The homestead is shutting down. Looks like Hannah's bringing them in once more. She's bringing them in. Bringing them in. Buck wild. Georgia, far left. Got Yaya out there. We got Lacey out there. Not Lacey around here, just Lacey. We got Big George looking down through the gate. Down yonder ways right yonder. There's Lacey in the middle. There's Yaya there. And, uh, like they're enjoying it so far. Stay tuned. not still a drop back there. It's impossible. <laughs> I balance this thing all the way from the pond side. Here comes Hannah with the jokes. Oh, we got all the chicks out. Marquise, you got to come get them. I thought you said it was game. I put them up in the brooder, and they said, we ain't standing no brooder. We out of here. 
Mm -hmm. Look right there on that roof. There they are. Let's get them guys caught back up. All right, folks. I got that old heart and got after it. And uh, we got it hooked up right now. We hadn't used this thing in probably a year. You can tell it's dirty. But uh, let me let me move it out yeah. so we can show you. Just trying to introduce to you the chickens. The Listen. baby chickies. Listen. Talking about ooh wee. Listen. I know I say everything's game, but I'm talking about game. game. I won't lie to you. Listen, I'm talking about red man game. We got us a few in here. What we've worked out is uh, we're going to raise them up in this brooder here because they was over at Marquise's house and they became kind of buffet. But uh, we're going to raise them in this brooder and uh, we're going to split them up at the end. We'll let them come over and pick what he wants. So stay tuned that video. will be arriving in the far, far future. But uh, that's all. I just wanted to kind of introduce them to y'all. And we're going to get the water and stuff set in here. And our light's coming through the roof here. That's what we're working on. So they can stay warm at nighttime. Thanks for watching. All right, y'all. Y'all know where we at. We in that feeding area. So therefore, you know what time it is. We're going to bring them in. And we're going to get after it. We got chickens back in the runner here. We've got to feed. We've got chicks inside here that we've got to feed as well. Uh, I'm going to feed our goats here. Oh, you know it. You see that, right? But listen, we're going to finish it up. Here they come in. Let me get something in my hand. Get, Put your hands on something. Put your hands on something. Let's find something to put my hands on. I'll let y'all come with us real quick as we feed the animals. And then we'll wrap this thing up. If, if we got any new followers, we'll go ahead and introduce everybody. That duck there quacking right in front of you, that's Nehemiah there. I'm Listen, Cross the Creek family, I'm sorry I have to introduce every video. I know it. Uh, we won't go through all of them, but we've got Indian Blues here as well. But uh, we're going to turn around and get some feed done. Because if I don't get no feed done, get my hands on something, I might get fired. I ain't trying to get put out. Coming in. Right, let's get, let's touch something here. Here we go. Here we go. We're gonna go in first here and feed our chicks here. We're gonna feed, we're gonna feed them up. We're gonna feed them up. We got to get every. Kelso, whoa, Kelso, in the short knife, I mean, I'm sorry. Y'all know a little bit about that Kelso in the short knife. Let's throw that on out there. Y'all reckon that's enough for this side? We gotta get us a little bit more here. Put my chicks on the, my chicks on the other side here. Really quick walk through what we planted here. You guys may see some of these rows dug out. We did. We planted again here. Y'all, we never stop working. If you talk about getting after it, we're who you're talking about. We planted here as well, here, 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 all the new rows that you see. We came, we saw, we conquered. That's what old Doc Rivers used to say. Old Doc Rivers. Knock out a couple more things. But y'all, today was a really, really productive day. We hate our fish die. That's why we call this thing the day of death. Marquise is a little sore about killing that chick around yonder ways. And uh, I wasn't so static about killing my fish either. So even all that aside, every day we get, we got to be grateful for. So I guess I got to learn how to be grateful, brother. Y'all, I put that camera down, but I wouldn't feel right if I didn't show Marquise this. They found that corn chiselating in there. I'm talking about. I'm going to name that one on the far right, Shorty Cowboy. There's no doubt. No doubt his name's Shorty Cowboy. But they found that corn and they getting after it in there. So now we're going to run over. And uh, 
Oh, I got to feed Georgiana. She's still in here on her peacocks. I'm going to translate a little bit of something in there for her. Just a little something. Just a little something. We don't like to overdo it. Well, a chick's that sitting that increases the temperature on them too much. and We like for it to be all natural. I said gooder. That's country. country more country than gooder. We get you a gooder hatch rate. We've got Hannah's over here too. This is her, where her laying, where she's moved her laying hens too. And if you come inside of here, come right down off inside of here. We'll show y'all. We got. Let's see, y'all there shy, shy as can be. We just, we just trizzle you down. We don't care. We didn't want to meet y'all no way. Guys, we're out of here. They don't want to see us. We don't have to see them either. I don't know who they think they are. Did you say something? Guys, they think these chickens, these animals around here think that they make the channel, and it's not. It's y'all. It's y'all across the creek family that makes the channel, not no chickens. I won't show them for two weeks now. Let's get over here. I want to show the long produce, my rolls here. You can see where I put that 41% right on down through there. And I took out a lot of them down the middle there. I've got some still here. Got a few. Got a few still there. Yeah. There you go, Miracle. Don't let her show you up. Yeah, she say, come on. She say, what's taking you so long to get down here? She's calling Bruce. Bruce ain't interested. Hey, Shelby. If y'all look down through there, Shelby's running around. She's got her rat. Oh, she's going in for the kill. Oh, she's letting him get away. She says, let's play. <laughs> Finishing them off right there. Y'all, I don't know why she does that. She'll just kill and kill and kill until she's full and eat, eat, eat until she's full. And when she's not hungry anymore, she just plays with them and tortures them. Oh, feel of old there. We're going to feed these puppies and check on these chicks. We've got them strapped down. This is what they'll be. We hadn't even dealt with that yet. Had fed the fish. Y'all, I was getting ready to try to film a, a closing for this thing, and it just dawned on me how many animals we've collected. What was I thinking? I think George say thanks for watching. Peace. <laughs>